we are kingdom of kings and priests that is whom you are as the children of God you cannot behave as you like you cannot begin to act as if you are going nowhere we are responsible children of God you are respected even among angels in heaven even when demons see you they fear you and you are afraid sometimes people some Christians are afraid of demons and demons they them say they are afraid of you too much oh. they are they don't even trust you that you cannot face sometimes they try you they try to attack you and but they are afraid of you that is whom you are we are kingdom of kings and priests demons fear us power darkness fear us and heavens respect us because we are too special we are too much Christ has done it for us to be so amen <laughs> Let, let's read the bible Esther chapter 19 and verse 6 our topic has been we are kingdom of kings and priests glory to god Esther chapter 19 and verse 6 and ye shall be unto me a kingdom of priests and a holy nation these are the words which thou shalt speak unto the children of israel God informed Moses to, you know, admonish the children of Israel that do you know who you are? Many of us rob yourself in sin. You take your father's wife, you steal, you do different things as if you are not responsible people. You don't know who you are. You are too responsible. My mind for you is to make you the kingdom of kings and priests. Christ had done that already. That was God's intention. And his intention and his mind came to pass when Christ came. And the Bible says Galatians 3.13 For Christ had delivered from the curse of the law and being made a curse for us. And he said, Woe is everyone that angered himself on a tree. Why? Well, because Galatians 2 verse 20 he said, I am crucified with Christ. Nevertheless, I live, yet not I, but Christ liveth in me. For the life I now live in the flesh, I live by the faith of the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. Glory to God in the highest place. Christ has given us the victory. He has made us kings and priests. That was God's original mind and intention for you. And ye are now kingdom of kings and priests. You know, someone asked me, say, if we are not kingdom of kings and priests, who are we going to rule over? Question God. Tell God who made you. How did you come about? Psalm 86 verse 10 said, God, thou art God alone. You live it by yourself. And that is how we are kings and priests. Kings have kingdom. And priests have the altar whereby they make sacrifice offerings to God and so they have the secret chamber where they offer sacrifice to God Psalm 91 verse 1 and 2 it says, he that dwelleth in the secret place of the most high shall abide under the shadow of the almighty as a priest is telling you to dwell in the secret place where you, you receive power and the disciples and God Christ told the disciples in the book of Acts chapter 1 he said that you shall receive power after the Holy Ghost has come upon you, we are in the secret chamber. It says, stay in Jerusalem. Jerusalem is the city of God. Inside the tabernacle, we have the priest secret place where we obtain power as priests of God to offer sacrifice before him. We don't need any tabernacle anymore to stay, though we gather together in the church, in the assemblies of the saints, but our tabernacle is now we, the tabernacle of God. We are now the temple of the Holy Ghost. And so we offer sacrifice to God. Uh, when God was instructing Moses to tell, you know, Aaron, you know, Aaron was the first priest ordained in the Bible. And Moses, you know, appointed Aaron, ordained him, and rubbed him with oil, you know, as an appointed vessel, the priest of God. 
and God told you know Moses and Moses told Aaron he said my mind is for you you know when you are making the the, the, the breastplate of righteousness to come into my presence so you have to put you know the breastplate and you know the typhoid and you have to put stones about 12 stones in the in the in the breastplate the breastplate is April, you know, the breastplate and the breastplate, when you put 12 stones, it presents the tribes of the children of Israel. And so when they put on the breastplate and in the secret place where they are praying, offering sacrifice to God as priests of God, then God will look on the breastplate and he see the 12 stones that represent the children of Israel. He remember the sins of the children of Israel and forgive us our sins. And so the breastplate we have to put on now as priests of God is the breastplate of righteousness. We don't need the physical breastplate like the Aaron was instructed you know to put on the breastplate to seek the face of God in a secret chamber in the secret base but now we have to put on the plate of righteousness the breastplate of righteousness in the Holy Ghost um, our topic has been you know we are kings we are the kingdom of priests we are the kingdom of kings and priests that is who you are. So our breastplate now we have to put on in the presence of God. It's been holy in the sight of God. First Peter chapter 1 verse 16. He said, Be ye holy, for God himself is holy. First Peter chapter 5 verse 7. They start casting all your cares on Jesus, for he careth for you. Jesus cared for you. Cast all your cares on him as a priest of God. You know, we are royal priesthood. The Bible says, First Peter 2, verse 9. It says, But ye are a chosen generation. A royal priesthood, a peculiar people, a, a holy nation that you should show for the praise of him who had brought you out of darkness into his glorious, marvelous light. If you hear me, shout hallelujah. If you hear me, shout hallelujah. We are the kingdom of kings and priests. And I told you before this body, as we shall we rover, God is our father. We are kingdom. And so Jesus Christ, our high priest. And so we are submissive to Jesus. And so God is the overall. Jesus Christ overall. So we are kings. And so how can you ask God who made you? We can't ask him. Some, you know, you can't ask him. Psalm 86 verse 10 says, For thou art God alone. So God is God that made himself. We don't question him at all. And so that is whom you are. here, kingdom of priests. Kingdom of kings. That is whom you are. A sister was going and passing through a road, and he passing through in a particular place, and a Christian sister was passing there, and some boys came around and said, "Hey, girl, stop there! I want, I just love you. I want you to be my girlfriend." And began to chase the girl, begin to you know, try to you know, make her a friend. And the Christian sister said, "Do you know who I am? Do you know? Do you think that I'm just a push away somebody?" Do you know do you do you think I'm a street girl? I am a royal priesthood, a queen, a child of a king. Do you know my father? And the unbelievers, the, the boys that wanted to chase, that wanted to, you know, make our friends say, We are sorry, we are sorry, we don't know. We don't know we are child of the king. He said, You don't know I child of the king, child of the kingdom. If you receive Jesus as your Lord, you'll be in that kingdom. If you hear me say amen. Hallelujah. And the testimony was given. And so if you hear me say amen, ye are kingdom of kings and priests. You know, the lady are called priestess. And you know that the, 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 the men are called the priests, amen. But in God's kingdom, we are neutral gender. Hallelujah. We are neutral gender. We are neutral genders. We are neutral gender. We are no man a woman. We are just like angels of God. The Bible said Revelation chapter 5 that Christ has made us kings and priests. Who made you kings and priests? Christ having died for Galatians 3 13. He said, For Christ and above from the cause of the law. Amen. He died for us. He suffered for us. And the Bible says, for 2 Timothy 2, verse 12. He said, If we suffer with him, oh, we shall also reign with him. He said, If we suffer, we shall also reign with him. He said, But if we deny him, he will deny us also. 
So don't deny Christ. We shall reign with Jesus. We are the kingdom of kings and priests. That was God's original intention that we are going to become. We are now the kingdom of God. We are the kingdom of priests and priests. And so we are to stay in the face of God. Kingdom of kings and priests. To rule over. And so the power of darkness, they are afraid of us. They are afraid of you. You know, every evil kingdom, you know, they bow. And so the kingdom of darkness, they are challenging us where they are, we are the kingdom of light. We are the kingdom of light. We are the kingdom of light like Jesus. The Bible says, Psalm 104 and verse 1 to 5. He said, Bless the Lord, O my soul. O Lord, my God, thou art very great. For thou art clothed with honor and majesty. Ah, that you have covered yourself with light as with a garment. <laughs> you have covered yourself like, with a light like a garment. You stretch out the heavens like a curtain. <laughs> oh, Maramato Korima Tadihese. Ira Tataleke Modama Hantiada. Ere Madama Ham. He said, You laid you lay the foundation, you lay the base of the chamber in the midst of the waters. You make the cloud your chariots. Thou walked in the wings of the winds. You make your angels spirits and your ministers flames of fire. You have laid the foundation of the earth so that it will not be removed forever. That is whom you are forever. That is whom you are called. And we are now made to worship you like this. To give you all the glory. You are the pen in the hand of a handwriter. You are the pen in the hand of a red writer. You are called. You created, between, you created barrier between land and waters. So the water will run through to the land. We are the kingdom of kings and of priests. Do you know who you are? Not everywhere kings and priests are found. You are so special. You are a king. You are a priest of God. To offer sacrifice. And you have a chamber seeking place to dwell. As a king, you have a throne. Kings have throne. Where is your throne? Your throne today is a seeking place. The Bible says, Book of Ephesians, chapter 2, verse 5 and 6, that Christ having died for us and has now made us to sit together with him in heavenly places. So we are seated together with Christ in heavenly places as kings, as kings and priests to offer sacrifice to God. If you hear me, shout hallelujah. The Bible says, Book of 1 Corinthians 12 and verse to. Yes, Lord. He said, You know that you were carried away unto these dumb idols. You were carried away unto dumb idols before to begin to worship idols. He said, But now Christ has delivered from the curse of the law. We are no more under the devil. Christ has delivered from the holy curse of the law. He said, But now Christ has delivered from the curse of the law. If we suffer with him, we shall reign with him. For Christ has made us king and priest. God intention originally. He said, I wish that above all things that he prosper and be in good health. As a child of God, be in good health for you. In the name of Jesus. God original intention. That was book of Jeremiah 29 verse 11. He said, My thought towards you are thought of good and not of evil. Thought of good and not of evil. That's God's original intention of mind. Bible, Sibu Kwasar 55, and verse over 8 and 9. He said, My thoughts are not your thoughts, neither my ways are your ways. As heavens are higher than the earth, so my ways are higher than yours. But now, Christ has died for us. God's thought is not our thought. He put his thoughts in our mind to think like him. He, he know that we should offer sacrifice. He you know Christ, you know, help us in heaven. The Bible says, Book of O God, Romans chapter 8 and verse 16. He said, The spirit of love of witness with our spirit. We are with the sons of God. Verse 26. He said, he said for, the, for the Holy Spirit of God, help us with grace and with prayers, which cannot be uttered when we are weak. So now we are kings and prisons. King and 
Please don't smoke anymore. They don't drink alcohol anymore. You know, they, they offer sacrifice to God. They clean themselves. We are not Nazarite. And Nazarite doesn't drink alcohol. Nazarite doesn't smoke. Nazarite doesn't, you know, fornicate. Nazarite doesn't, you know, do evil. Nazarite of God, they stay clean. They are the priests of God. We are not Nazarite. We are not priests and kings. And in before God in the screen throne. In Labato, we are kingdom. Of kings and priests. Calabado. David was a king and a priest. David was a king and a priest. Samuel was a prophet and a priest. So God always wants to join the two together because we have kingdom to reign. We have kingdom to reign. We reign in Christ with God. Le botan brakata le kibodo hon. Ira batan tamati azeketi ezi. Ara da da da. And you know that the kings have territory. They reign over. They have kingdom. They reign over. They have provinces. They have you know states. They have states and cities. They reign over provinces and communities. They reign over. And so we shall reign over. We shall reign with Christ. 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 Kwazo kwa bona kala tina sofa na na e kwazo kwa bona kala tina sofa na na e tina sofa na na e tina sofa na na e. So we shall see him. We shall be like him. We shall see. We shall be like him. We shall reign together with Christ in every places as kings and priests. Kwazo kwa bona kala tina sofa na na e kwazo kwa bona kala tina so. But we shall see, we shall be like him. We shall reign with him. We shall reign with him. Labado Brokonodo. Il la bantambra hatebo. Zira panta matoro kodia. Lele kutuma brakatiri keziada. El le tilba telebotana paikezi. Kasuka balata rekezi. Krakuta balaba tika bado. La balata la botana katigezi. Kisa katalata na katigezi. Kasuka balata la botiga nazili. Kisa da balibo. Kila batala tiaza. Kisa katala batiada. We shall reign with him. We shall reign with him. We shall reign with Jesus. In la paramatan kutu yezi. Zita la matan brokutia. Balama krankusi matie. Karo kasa palabatan nanda. Kelebotan mahanti asa. Kelebotan mahanti atahegezi. Aratata. Eka badakata. We have different kings and their types. What type of king are you? Are? What type of king are you? Are you Kung Uzziah? The Bible said that King Uzziah need to die for Isaiah to see God clearly. Every Kung Uzziah that's injuring your way not to reign in Christ. In la tata la kata, we stop them by fire. We stop them by fire. We stop them by fire. And whosoever is making you to cry, that you should be happy. Allah Mado, let them cry your cry and take happiness. Allah Mado, we cry your cry. Then we cry your cry. There are some kings they are weeping. You know, you know, during the time of David, David was a king, but his son, his son Adonijah, made him to weep. He made him to weep. He laughed at the lock of Bodaba. Anyone that wants to make you weep. Allah Mado Brokoto will silence them by fire. Ye are kings and priests. Allah Mado Brokoto Makata. Ye are priests and priests. Harado Kabara. We shall not cry. We shall celebrate. We shall celebrate with Christ in heavenly places. Thank you because you have made us the kingdom of kings and priests in Christ Jesus. Amen.